Welcome to PC Wits Kids Tech Talk. Today I want to show you a quick shortcut on how to delete your recent history. So not the files themselves, but what you recently worked on. So to get into the recent folder right now, you'd have to go into your C colon backslash documents and settings administrator slash recent. If your user ID is not administrator, then you just replace that with your user ID. But the point here is we can create this little shortcut that when you double click on it, it will go to that folder, that default system folder that contains the history and what you recently worked on and delete everything in it. So copy and paste these four lines of code here into Notepad and then just save it as anything you want. Just save it as a file name, but it has to end with a .js extension, okay? That's the key. So I called it here delete recent items.js. Alright, so look look for the info here attached with this video so you can cut and paste the information. I'm gonna do a quick uh, test here. If I create um, a text file somewhere, it saves that in history that I created this text file. There it is. In the recent history, it shows that I created this new text file. Now I want to flush that from the history. I double click on that and then I flip over back to the folder and it's gone from the history, right? That's what the point of this is, to flush and clear away what you recently worked on, not the files. It doesn't delete the files. It just knows to go into the system default area that contains the recent history information and delete everything that's in there. Okay, that's the point of this script. Okay, so it's safe, easy to use, and uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.